back here at, at the uh, Department of Housing and Urban Development. I'm Basha P. Jordan Jr., the pastor of Hope and our ministry. And we're here at the uh, um, COP and the CDC event where the black colleges and universities have come together here in Washington, D.C. And I have with me uh, Pastor Gaines, Bishop Gaines uh, from uh, Baltimore, Maryland. And he's a good friend of, of ours. And he came over with us on the bus. And, and it's because of, of Bishop Gaines that I'm even a part of this clergy event. Uh, how are you uh, this morning, Bishop Gaines? By God's grace, I'm doing fine. By God's grace. What is it that brings you here to Washington, D.C., to this uh, CDC uh, event, historically black colleges and universities? And what, are the, what, are, what is the expectation of the clergy? Well, we're here because we believe that uh, our motto is we can do together what one cannot do alone. And anyone who occupies the community is a part of the community and must be able to address the issues of the community. Uh, Coppin State College has reached out to the pastors in the community and we are joining together to make a change in the community which we work, live, and play. What has, has, the, has, has a difference been made since clergy have been working with Coppin and Coppin working with the clergy? Tremendous difference. Uh, the, first of all, the gap has been bridged. Uh, we, we understand that, um, that the Jesus was very balanced in his teaching. If we look at the time that he was approached in reference to taxes. And when the taxes uh, were to be paid, he said, render to Caesar Caesar, and God wishes God. The, the church cannot do it by itself, and uh, the government cannot do it by itself. So we got to bridge that gap, and I see that taking place with Compton and the Courage of Congress. Uh, Mr. Gaines, I just want to thank you for um, even getting us together. You know, you, you've been doing this for a few years now, getting us together. I want to thank, thank God for uh, using you as an emissary to even uh, uh, get us involved with Coppin and all that you're doing. What really got you involved with bringing the clergy together here in Baltimore? Well, I, I, uh, I was blessed to, to go to the church that I grew up in uh, in 1975, opened up a mission, went to McCullough Street, I grew my mission, and I was looking to go to a place where I can grow without putting expenses. I got to that home church, we outgrew the church, I sat there one Sunday, and I said, well, what would I do next? I don't want to repeat the mistake that so many ministries I think have made, and that is built for attendance with our relationship. I, I asked my elders to take over the service. I went out and I walked through the community and saw all the different churches in the community of men I did not know. So then it sought me with the desire to get to know those pastors. And um, we know we're passing from death into life because we love the brother. And I desire to meet them. Yes. Uh, could I have the, Thank you so much. Bishop Coppin Gaines, I'm Dr. Bosch B. Jordan Jr., pastor and founder of Hope Alive Ministry. Remember, no matter what's going on with you today, there is hope for you. Wow. All right.